Hi, Gary here. You know, I was in Phoenix, so mid-March, taking an Uber ride, and then asked the gentleman how he's doing that day, and he said, eh, not so good. I, I just found out from running my TurboTax that I'm going to owe $5,000 for my 25000 of earnings that I made outside of my regular job for Uber. And he said, I'm going to have to hire an accountant. In fact, I'm going to go see one tomorrow. And he said, just hold on a second. I asked him a few questions, and after about 10 minutes of discussion, he realized he could eliminate all that tax. He was very excited about that. So what did I, what happened there? Well, first, let me give you a little bit of statistics. There's a report called the 2015 1099 Economy Workforce Report. You can see it here. Uh, that basically stated that uh, 20 years ago, people who had were in the workforce had separate gigs doing something separate from the regular job or just doing it full time was 6% of the workforce. That's now 34%. It's a big change. So a lot of folks like this gentleman doing these extra gigs out there, and they're now self-employed persons. Well, they don't realize that a whole world of benefits opened up. I mean, they understand they get the deductions from you know, regular business activities and so forth, and that's great, and that works well. But after those deductions, he's sitting there with 25000 of earned income. Has to pay Social Security tax on it, federal and state. Well, what I shared with him was in an employee benefit area called a solo 401k slash profit sharing plan. You might say, well, what is that? Well, let me just give you the basics of it here. But basically, he didn't have a 401k plan at his full-time job. So he could fully utilize this. And in his case, and get this, on the 25000 earned income, he could put away $22,650. That's huge. That's almost the entire amount. In fact, in his 25% bracket, that's over $5,000 of tax savings. So he more than takes care of this liability. Now, he happened to have $40,000 he was saving up for retirement on a taxable basis. So we just flipped the money over and make it on a tax deferred basis, and it's huge, huge, really big. Put it this way, if he just does it one year, going out, to, he's 40 years old, going out to age 60, at 6%, <laughs> he accumulates an extra $32,000, just on that first year. If he did that every year to age 60, the difference is $300,000 more. Now that is big. That's the difference between understanding what's available to you as a self-employed person and taking an advantage of these things. That's so very important for the sharing economy and all these jobs that are out there that people are freelancing uh, and, and making money to be aware of all these different benefits that are afforded to them as self-employed persons to do this. So if you know someone or you that's in the sharing economy and they're making extra income on top of what they're currently earning or they're doing it solely, make sure they check this out. Make sure they're aware about what the benefits are that they have as a self-employed person. It's very, very important. Switching gears, we have our spring barbecue cleaning event on Saturday, June 4th from 10 o'clock in the morning to 2 in the afternoon. We're also going to have a shredding. Uh, we're going to have um, uh, a giveaway to um, charity. Uh, there's going to be the barbecue truck here. Uh, you can get old electronics. Uh, there's going to be a little band. I mean, it's going to be a great time. It's going to be a lot of fun. So I invite you to come and take care of some of that spring cleaning that you want to get out of the way and make your house a little more livable. So until next time, enjoy.